Hey guys, um, you'll probably notice by the title of this video that this one's going to be a bit different and it's just a one-off thing and I wanted to actually just kind of talk to you guys to let you know what my plans are going forwards. Um, I'm going to go ahead and just get straight to the point and say that I'm wanting to improve the quality of my content. I want to have better equipment, better software, better mics, and be able to invest more Right now, the equipment I have, the software I have, it doesn't allow me to create the content to the quality that I want, despite the amount of time I put into videos. You know, I can put in six hours on a video and it still comes out pretty subpar compared to like some of my favorite YouTubers who do similar things to what I'm doing of lore videos for different universes. And I would love to reach that level, but to do so, I need some help. So what I'm doing is I'm setting up a Patreon campaign. And before you X out or just start typing stuff in the comment section, hear me out in that this is not a cry for you to empty your wallet. This is not a begging video. This is just a system of when you get, you know, if every month you get your paycheck or whatever and you pay your bills, you take your spouse out for all the fun things you want to do, you go out to the movies, you spoil yourself, you give some money to orphans in need or animals that need homes or whatever. If after all of that, you have four quarters lying under your bed and you find them and say, oh, I've got this extra dollar and you would like to dedicate that dollar to reward me for the content that I make on YouTube, that'd be awesome. I would love to have a dollar a month. That would be absolutely amazing. So that's what this essentially is, is introducing a way for you guys to be able to reward me directly for my content, if you enjoy it. If you don't enjoy it, you are under no obligation whatsoever. Please don't feel obligated to donate any amount per month. I'm still going to be putting out videos. I'm still going to be doing all the stuff I do normally at the fastest pace I can while trying to constantly improve my quality, regardless of what the Patreon page is going on. Um, the Patreon is just there to help me along with that process for those of you who are interested in being involved and helping me with that. So if you decide you want to dedicate $1, $5, $10, whatever a month to helping me out, um, that would be super amazing um, and would help me improve my quality faster, get videos out faster, get help to make sure that the videos are just the best quality possible, learning new techniques for editing and recording and all that stuff. But um, no one's going to be cut out of content or anything because they don't donate. There's not going to be a punishment for people who don't donate. Of course, there will be incentives for those of you who decide to. Little things like um, becoming one of my students to learn Warhammer Fantasy. Um, for those of you who are interested in something like that or getting to join certain Google Hangouts where we'll talk about various parts of the lore and things like Total War Warhammer, doing things like um, having some influence on what ne what lore videos are going to be next on the channel, uh, things of that nature. And you'll see on my Patreon page all the different incentives for different donating amounts. Um, but that pretty much is the whole spiel of it. I'm going to be putting a video in the description box of this um of this video, so a link, I should say, that's going to take you to a video that a content creator I really like and admire made that explains his views on Patreon and why he finds it much better than YouTube ads. Um, you might have started to notice that I'm setting up ads on my videos, but I'm s hoping to just avoid that in the long run. Um, that being said, they will be around for a while um, until things can really get rolling. Um, or they might be there forever, and if so, that's okay. But we'll figure it out together. That's what this is about, is about moving forward with you guys as a community, which is what I've always wanted, rather than me just sort of being this aloof figure. I want to connect with you guys. I want to know you guys. That's why I love it when you guys comment in the comment section, even if it's just something really short, like, hey, great job, or, I mean, if you just want to tell me how your day was, have at it, man. I'd love to hear it. But... So that's kind of the spiel on Patreon. Um, you'll, you can go to my Patreon page, which I'll have a link to in the description below. And this video will also be featured on my Patreon page. 
that will uh, allow you to go to my page, see all the different incentives, see what my goals are, all that stuff. Though, for those of you who just kind of want to hear what the future of the channel is going to be like, this part's for you. So here's the thing. There are three little sections I kind of want to go over, which are things that I'm looking to upgrade, things that are coming to the channel no matter what, and then things that would come to the channel if it were upgraded. So let's start with the new things coming to the channel regardless, because that's inevitable. It's going to happen. Uh, first, very, very soon, like this week, we're going to be starting the map series, which is me. I'm going to be uh, dissecting and producing lore videos about all of the different regions on the map that was released for the Total War Warhammer game, so their campaign map. Obviously, I won't be releasing the map itself because it's not public yet, and I. But the last thing I'd want to do is do something Creative Assembly would not be okay with. So what we're going to be doing instead is just going over vague regions and trying to find all the really awesome little things. Because I'll tell you what, I've been looking at their map and I've already discovered a lot of really amazing things that I think are going to be very important aspects of the game and the map. So really look forward to that series. I'm really excited. Um, next is going to be the Racial series. Um, this has been going up in requests now for a while. It's been kind of building, building, building. When I initially made my channel, I did not want to make videos that were just like, Skaven, here's everything I have ever to say on Skaven. Because you can go to any Warhammer channel in the universe, and you will always find a video on like, here's a video for the Empire, and here's a video for the Skaven, and all this stuff. But... Um, now that my channel is a lot better established and I have a community, I have you guys and I'm getting to start to interact with you guys and I talk to some of you on Steam and all that stuff, I feel a lot more confident now about covering that ground because I can assure you I can provide content that uh, no one else can. That sounds very arrogant, but I feel <laughs> as I've gotten to know the community better and observe all the YouTube base, I feel pretty confident that I've got a fairly good grasp on Warhammer that... Uh, does not seem to be easily rivaled, and I'm really proud of that. I really am. Um, the next kind of stuff I'd like to do that's going to be coming to the channel is lore on video games, such as Vermintide, which, if you don't know, Vermintide came out very recently, or I think it's about to come out. Um, and I have it. I can't play it, which we'll get into that in a minute, but I'm aware of it and have watched other people been playing it. And there's a lot of lore about that game that's not that's pr not super well, like, it's not hidden per se, but I'd love to dive into it and just explore all the little nooks and crannies that people might not get initially. Um, we'll talk about Vermintide more um, in a little bit. Um, next would be, I'm going to start uploading actual Warhammer games that I play against my students, uh, against the occasional friend who challenges me to a match, and also little lessons. So, like, we'll have a short video on how to kind of generically do the movement phase, though I'm not going to get too into detail. It's just going to be a little thing there that would help, like, a veteran player, for instance, who played 7th edition but didn't play 8th to sort of get an idea of what's going on with the edition changes. And last but not least, which coming to, what's coming to the channel are collaboration videos with other YouTube channels. Uh, I have one already scheduled that should be coming up pretty soon once we actually get a date worked out and taken care of. And once those videos start hitting, I would love to work with as many YouTubers as I can that do anything with, you know, Warhammer-themed video games, Warhammer Fantasy lore, all that stuff. I'd love to get to know all of them. There's a lot of really great content creators out there, and I have a lot of respect for the work they've already done, and I would like to move forward and see if there are little fun things that I can talk to them about and play games with them and all that stuff. Um, okay, so with that out of the way, let's go ahead and talk about things that I'm looking to upgrade, because obviously if I'm starting a Patreon page, that means I'm looking to do something, doesn't it? So there are six, well, five really big things that I'm looking to accomplish. Uh, the first is that, uh, as I'm sure some of you have noticed, I have not the best computer in the universe because I work on kind of a laptop, of just a little Intel laptop I bought about a year and a half ago. Um, I have a large desktop that had a lot of very powerful hardware, but unfortunately some of it was damaged quite badly and it ceased to function. So my first goal would be to get that thing up and running again as fast as possible because that would enable me to do 
a lot of things that I can't do right now, um, such as streaming uh, video games like Blood Bowl 2 or Vermintide, um, downloading much more intensive editing software beyond just Windows Media Player, uh, which goes into my second point, which would be uh, software and hardware would be number two. So those Patreon funds would be going towards getting actually semi-professional at least, recording software, getting a, the nicest microphone I can get my grubby little hands on, um, getting better hardware to make sure the computer is nice and upgraded to handle everything that's coming out, all that stuff. Uh, third, of course, would be uh, optimizing my recording equipment, so better mic, um, better room, <laughs> things around where I record to make sure that the sound quality is better and you can't hear my little fans and stuff in the background or my dog moving around and all that stuff. Um, fourth would be more books. Uh, you can never know too much Warhammer Fantasy lore, and although I know an absolute metric ton of it, I don't actually know all of it, though I'm really close. There's actually a good, I'd say, ten or so books that I'm missing, and I would really love to get those books and finish my Warhammer library once and for all. Especially since Warhammer is, unfortunately, an ended saga, so to speak, it would be nice to finally collect the rest of the books and have the complete Warhammer series. But I'm close, but that would be something I'd be interested in doing. And finally, something I think that would be a really nice upgrade to the channel would be uh, finding an editor. Finding someone who would be willing to work with me on a really regular basis to make sure that the videos are actually really interesting and fun to watch um, and allow just for sort of the basic material so that, you know, it's not just like this video where I have a single static image showing in the back because there's not really a whole lot that I can do with images right now. I'm learning. I, I am, but it's it's a slow process. And it would be nice to have someone who's much more skilled be able to help me along with that process and take over majority of the work while I sort of learn to build my way up to it. Uh, I'd also like to bring in a friend of mine who's a composer to do little things like composing an opening theme for all the videos so that, you know, there's a little tag that when you open the video, you know that this is a lore master of SoTech video and it's no one else's and it's super awesome and fun. Um, and maybe even creating original music for the channel, which would be really amazing. Um, and then lastly would be an animator. That's like the ultimate dream though, is the animator. Cause that would allow me to do things that I have some really cool ideas for like uh, creating death battles between Warhammer special characters or animated fight scenes between different armies or a series I would like to call the humor of the Warhammer series, which would be basically having a character like uh, Croak, for instance, coming back from the dead and him having to be updated on everything that's happened since he died um, long, long ago during the first war against chaos and the rather humorous reactions of how everything's just gone horribly awry, but with a really lighthearted take on it that would at this, which would be good for showing world events from a lore perspective while also keeping it really funny and interesting. And also little skits that I've thought of that are really funny. Um, one I'll kind of give you, I'll just tell you guys about, um, just cause it's something I'd like to do, but I can't do it right now is so in my last video, Colex Sun Eater, uh, you'll note that he, I told you that he smashes the wall of, uh, Prague in a single blow. And what I really would have liked to do, um, for that clip when I'm talking about it, well, I was really serious about it, so maybe not that, but what I'd like to do in this joke series, for instance, is throw in a clip of, if any of you have seen Attack on Titan, when the, the large Titan, the giant Titan, the big one, the huge, you know, the master Titan smashes the wall, um, and so instead of having, you know, the Titan looking over the wall and smashing it open in Attack on Titan, we could just copy paste the image of Colex Sun Eater's face over his face. That way it looks like he's kicking down the wall of Prague, which to me is hilarious. I don't know if anyone else finds that funny. I find that hilarious. And we could have Aaron, like, I don't know, we could just post a picture of, like, Magnus the Pious on his face or something while he's all freaked out looking. Um, <laughs> sorry, that got me all excited and amused. And of course, uh, Let's Play on Warhammer games. Um, I've got stuff like, you know, the Mark of Chaos series, which I really enjoy, despite the fact they're not the best games in the universe. Um, Vermintide, Blood Bowl, Blood Bowl 2, uh, Total War Warhammer, etc. Shadow of the Horn Rat, all those really awesome Warhammer games. So that's kind of 
the idea. That's where we're wanting to go with this. Um, like I said earlier, this Patreon page is not meant to make anyone feel obligated to donate to me. I want to get to know you guys. I want to build a community first and foremost. I want to be the best Warhammer channel on YouTube second. And then I'd like to make money off my channel third. And maybe fourth or fifth. I can even, I'm can. i sure that's for even further down the list. Um, I'm just sort of rambling here. But so with that said, um, this is an opportunity for you guys to support me if that's something you're interested in. If you've got leftover money at the end of the month and you decide that you'd like to put it towards helping out my channel um, grow and become bigger and be one of the people to feed the serpent, as I say, to sacrifice the proverbial skaven to the serpent god Sotek and make my channel grow, make the comet in the sky grow larger, that would be amazing. Um, that would be... I'm would be humbled beyond belief just for even a single dollar from one person and that'd be it. That would be that that would be great. That's still a Snickers bar at the store to help me when I'm making videos. So at the end of the day, that's all this is. Is this is a promotional offer for people who would like to be more involved, people who want to help out the channel, or people who just want those incentives for the different donation amounts, or people who just want to see the videos go up. But for those of you who donate, you'll be helping everyone. You'll be helping me. You'll be helping everyone who watches the channel because my con as my content gets better, it gets the videos get better for everyone. So everybody wins. Um, and if you are donating, then you get incentives, which means you win too. So literally everyone has something to gain. Uh, but like I said, it's not expected. I'm not trying to muscle anyone or pester anyone. Um, and I've probably said that so many times you're getting annoyed by now. So... Um, if you can't tell, I'm moderately nervous about this. So feel free to talk to me down in the comment section below. Um, feel free to visit my Patreon page. Feel free to do whatever you decide is right for you. If you want to donate, great, amazing, awesome. If you don't want to donate, great, amazing, awesome. I still love you. I still love you so much. You're awesome. You're beautiful. You're wonderful. You're literally the like the most amazing person on earth, and you should have a great day every day. But that will pretty much wrap up this little video. Um, this obviously will not count as a daily video because I finally have figured out how to um, upload my videos in advance. So it's actually possible for me to do a daily upload, which is great. So I'm hoping you guys are appreciating having a video come out every day instead of my sporadic schedule. So like I said, the content's getting better. We're getting there. Day by day, week by week, we're getting there. Thanks so much for listening. I hope to see you, see you guys, talk to you guys, get to know you guys. And I hope you all have a great night.